Good morning and welcome to my channel, Craft Time with Yaya. And I'm Yaya. <clears throat> Thank you for joining me. If this is your fourth, first time, welcome. If this is your second, third, fourth, fifth time, thank you for coming back. I appreciate that. And I appreciate you. All right, we have an unboxing here from Diamond Art Club. Their motto, do what makes you sparkle. And I so truly enjoy diamond painting. This is the missing kit from the mystery box that I did um, a little bit ago. And it was supposed to have six kits in and it only had five. So this is the one that's missing. And if I'm not mistaken, it is the fan favorite. Ay, yeah, yeah, and I'm beyond disappointed. So beyond disappointed. I don't do the fantasy. I don't do the witchcraft. I don't do any of that stuff. So basically, I spent $215 on two paintings because that's all I'm keeping. This. Um, yeah, I knew I shouldn't have, I knew I shouldn't have got in, I shouldn't have did the mystery box because I figured it was probably going to be more of what I didn't want than what I did want, but I did want the experience. And so I have the experience. Nice. A very expensive experience because basically I'm keeping two of the kits and that is it so all right um, toolkit sticker box canvas do what makes you sparkle Yeah, so this will definitely be a kit that I will not be keeping. So. Alright. Uh, this is what it looks like. Green is my color for sure. Alright, so... It comes with a little sticker you can put on the box. Big sticker if you choose to use that. It has 16 colors. Uh, Potions Professor. Yeah, that's a no. Lots of dark colors. Square. Okay. All right, let's take a look at the toolkit and see what's up in here. This is always fun. The tool kits are always fun to see what special little goodies you will get. Oh, there's a cute little cover minder right there. And washi tape. And the boat without a stopper. This one didn't come with a stopper, so I don't know if that was uh, a faux pas or if they're not going to be sending the stoppers anymore. I don't know. Either way it go, I don't use them, so it doesn't matter to me. All right, and tweezers only come with square. They're branded. So those will be for my baby girl. She uses those. This kit will go into my student store. Um my babies at work to buy not the cover minder though that goes to my collection that will go into my collection okay let me move some of this stuff out the way these I keep that goes that goes that goes that goes um, I'll even leave the placers in there and then I have to just remember to put a tray in there when I exchange them out. 
and those are the things that I keep. All right, let's move on to the next painting with this customized bookshelf. This also came in the mystery box. Um, the other one um, that I will be opening also came from the mystery box. So let's take a look. This is my first Randall Spangler. Um, not sure if I will be keeping this one or not. The other three um, that came in the kit which was Spinia, uh, Spinia, Natalie can't think of the other ones. Uh, there were two more I've already disposed of those. Gotten rid of those. Uh, regular toolkit. This is the older toolkit, not regular. Older toolkit. And it has two plates of wax, tray, pen, washi, baggies. I mean, not washi. Um, squishy. Everything you need to get it done is in there. So... Let's get into this baby. I don't, I tear up the bags getting stuff in and out because I don't keep the bags. But I do keep the boxes and I store them in the boxes. And then I like to put this little bitty one right here. So either they will be stored horizontal where I can still see it or vertical still see it um but i'm running out of room i'm running out of room in my closet uh, for my dining painting so i have to move i have to move so i have more room for my dining painting <laughs> i that is ridiculous isn't it but it is what it is i need to move i need more diamond painting room all right here is the legend and it has stickers. You can pull them off and put them on your containers or whatever you use to label up. I don't, I just cut it and I use this as a walking legend. And because I turn my canvas in all directions, I take my walking legend and whichever direction I have my canvas in, that's how I keep the legend. So if I have it like this and I'm painting and all my symbols are this direction, I turn my legend this direction. Because as you can see, sometimes you have arrows that are going in the opposite direction. And if you're not careful and paying attention, you will mix up those symbols. So that's why I use the walking legend and I orient it the way my painting is oriented. All right, this is a round. It is labeled in case you keep your drills uh, separate from your canvas. Um, I don't normally open the bags, but I am going to start doing that because I think some people enjoy it. So I won't, I probably won't do it on every canvas, but at least one if I do multiple in a day or in a video rather. All right. So let's take a look at these colors. Oh, I forgot to check for ABs. We have anything below 150, so 149 down is an AB uh, diamond for Diamond Art Club. And that is Aurora Borealis diamond. It has a special iridescent coating put over the top to help it sparkle a little bit more. And we have one and two in this canvas and this is a 92 by 41 centimeter so it is thin as you can see and long so i was almost gonna say this is would be the biggest painting but it's not i did a custom of a 60 by 90 of my daughter and her family when we went on our uh trip to San Francisco. So that was interesting. Okay, so 
We have three, three, seven, one. We have one, two, three, four bags of that. Three, four, three, four, seven. Why is that three? That is not a three, Sonia. Come on, girl. That is a six. <laughs> six, four, seven, two. Six, four, five, two of those. Nine, oh, five, three of those. Oh, those are pretty. Pretty green is my favorite color. So if you didn't know, now you know. All right. 904, two of 904, 3853, two of 646. That's a pretty color. Okay, that's one set. We have 814. I think this is one of my favorite colors. 400, 976, 3777, 895. Ooh, only one bag of 310. Woohoo! 996. Oh, that's a pretty color. That's a pretty color. strings. All right. Well, there's our first AB. You see that? See that extra little sparkle on there? That's the iridescent coating. Oh, that is such a pretty color. the other AB. We have two in this kit. Oh, that is pretty. Okay. That is so pretty. Yep, that is so pretty. Alright, so there's all the drills. I will put those away later. Let's take a look at the canvas. Okay, let's turn it around the correct orientation. All right. Okay, look at these babies. Oh, and it's called customizable. No, customized bookshelf. So I guess if I wanted to fart around with it, I could create names of books and put in here. That would be interesting. That would be something I would um, ask my students to help me with. And then we would come up, looks like one, two, three, four, five books we would come up with titles of five books that we enjoy reading in class. And then I will attempt to put them on there. And then when I get this completed, I will frame it and then hang it in my library. Oh, this is cute. This is cute. Let me fold it, fold it. Let me roll it backwards. As if you roll it backwards, it'll lay flat quicker but it will flatten on its own pretty easy. This is uh, tarpaulin uh, material. That's what Diamond Art Club uses. Oh my goodness, I thought I had cleaned this table off of all this dust. Oh well. So you can roll it backwards 
and then it will help it lay flat quicker. See that? Damn, there we go, baby. Laying pretty flat. All right, so that is customized. Customized bookshelf by Ronald Spangler. Round, 41, 92 centimeters by 42 centimeters. That is super cute. I'm excited. I get excited over every new dining table. That's just, you know, you know how we do. People that dine and paint quite often, we all pretty much say the same thing. Oh, that's so pretty. Oh, I want to do it right now. Oh, oh, oh. But then we got 900,000 million uh, diamond paintings <laughs> in our stash that needs to be completed. But every time we get a new one, we want to do that one. So... I feel your pain. I feel your pain. All right, let's get into this one. Neptune and Triton by Hannah Lynn. All right, let's go for it. Round. So let's get in this baby. A toolkit. Hey, remember, this is the new toolkit. This is the old toolkit. So they're still in transition. So if you get an older kit that's already been in stock, more likely than not, it's going to have the old uh, kit that does not have a cover minder and it does not have washi tape. But basically, okay, this is Hannah Lynn, Neptune and Triton. Um... I've already unboxed it and went through everything and then realized my camera has stopped recording. So here we are again, trying it again. So here she is. She has 56 colors, four ABs. AB stands for Aurora Borealis. They have an extra sparkle on them so they shine just a little bit more. This is a round kit. 51 by 71, licensed from Han Hannah Lynn. So, let's keep going and hopefully my camera doesn't act up again, my phone. I think I'm gonna have to just go out and get something else because this is irritating. All right, so we have 56 colors. These are individuals. You can pull them a piece apart and put them on your kit, uh, your containers if you choose to. As I said earlier, I use it as a walking legend. So we have some fours here. So sprinkling of ABs in here. We have some ones in here. Some sprinkles, twos in here, threes. Where would the, oh, there's some threes. There's some threes right in there. So, um, there she is. I'm going to go through the colors quickly for you. Um, they are packaged uh, with their names in case you keep them separate. Crinkling, coming. Okay, so lots of three tens. Oh, there's an AB right there. There's that sparkle on it. That's how you know it's an AB. You can see the extra sparkle. 